Welcome back, one and all, to Persona 5. I am the Dark Seraph. Last time, we've learned that Joker is a bit of a sneaky son of a bitch, and I love it. I'm gonna head back then. They faked Joker's death through use of cognition, and I absolutely adore it, and I love it. I freaking love it. I catch you got the last laugh. We can finally have rest in peace. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Or said that MLB fact. And everyone loves a catchy. I don't. Phew. Is it Commodo? Your nosy audio is different. My mic blew out, so I'm going mono on my dynamic microphone here. <laughs> I get to hang out in the house pretty much. That's a lie, right? Well, how did you know? I just knew. Planning something with Sakamoto kun and the others, huh? Well, try not to trouble the school or the parents, okay? Make sure you keep up with your studies. I'll handle your housework as long as you request me. Interesting. Kawakami isn't stupid. Cut that out. Hmm. Oh yeah, Nakechi's a backstabbing son of a bitch, but we I kind of saw that coming. Problems here. Okay. I ordered a trilby a couple days ago and it came today, so sitting over there in the corner. Yeah, they're trying to figure out in from dirt on Shido. What is it? You going out? That's the plan. You gotta be kidding me. <sighs> Just don't stay out too late. I've got the hood up, don't worry. Keshi isn't here. Although he should probably be wearing a face mask, medical mask. I like the aviators. Let's begin at once. Police, we already have Masayo Shishido and Diet Building. All we need is what he thinks of this place. Maybe Mount Fuji, since it's the highest place in the country? Hopefully the not. not what about a mansion? Since he's met. going to subjugate everyone as prime minister. Perhaps a school? What about an arena, like the Colosseum? Imperial been Palace? Conditions have not been met. It's no good. I thought we would have gained entry by now. Maybe we shouldn't have called you here. Hey, you think he's guarding his whole palace with a barrier? Shido stole the cognitive science research, right? Or well, maybe it had some special move written in it. Is that even possible? Who knows? I've got no idea. There was nothing like that in the notes I saw. Anyways, what kind of person is Shido? I can't figure him out. I mean, he tried to have his way with a woman. I did some light research on him last night, but I couldn't get a grasp on the type of man he is. Other than egomaniacal? Over there is probably a legislator, right? I'll try asking him. Excuse me, 
I'm a member of the newspaper club at my high school. May I speak with you for a moment? Sure. What kind of person is Representative Shido? What's he think about the national diet? His stance is dedication for country. It's how he's garnered everyone's trust. He's an admirable man of action, with a first-class determination. I'd say he's a model politician. And I'm not just saying that because he can have me killed on a whim. I believe that he'll help create a wonderful future in which young adults like you can live in ease. An exemplary answer. It makes sense he wouldn't tell teenagers anything unnecessary. Look over there. He's on a walkie-talkie. Wait, is it about us? That doesn't look good. We should leave at once. Tomorrow's a day off, so let's have an early strategy meeting. Meet at LeBlanc, okay? I should really be wearing a clinical mask. We should all think about this tonight. I mean, the hood and aviators help, but that only distinguishes part of your face. You need to completely disguise it. I have a polyurethane mask, although I wear that when it's frickin' cold. The criminals calling themselves the Phantom Thieves are no more. That's what you think! However, I believe that this country's citizens are still living their days in anxiety. These scandals only increase our distrust of the current government. As a citizen myself, I am enraged. Look who's talking. What does it mean to be a politician with responsibility? Working toward personal gain without consideration of the country is outrageous. <sighs> the election's public notification is tomorrow. No matter where I go, people are cheering for Shido. Everyone's being deceived so easily. Insert political joke here. Yeah. In order to save this country that has been tainted by villains, social reform is essential. Ugh. Socialism is bad. Mm. What the? That's new. Play a game. Mm. Only we knew the keyword. Okay, Phantom Thief support is around three percent. That's something. Last one. Diamond mine. Have not no good. How many do we miss? <sighs> Perhaps he truly does have a barrier up. Right? That's not something to be excited about. We know all the way up to diet building, too. So you enter keywords into the metaverse navigator. Boss, can you turn the TV on? Shido might be on it. Sure thing. Goro Akechi. Him and his stupid composed face. So, Akechi-san, is it true you withdrew yourself from the media as part of your plan to capture the Phantom Thieves? I truly apologize for causing such a stir. Honestly, it required a lot of courage to openly oppose them when their popularity was at its peak. I mean... People often lashed out at me online and whatnot. Then was it also your plan when you said they weren't at fault after their popularity declined? That was to catch them off guard. I could say I applied my profiling knowledge. Once they lost public support, someone they thought was their greatest enemy led to hand. 
That's the same strategy used in romance, wouldn't you agree? All's fair in love and war. Even if he is a condescending little fuck nut. Why is he being treated as an ace detective of justice? Because fake news. It's not just on TV or online. Newspapers, magazines. I see his face everywhere. On the other hand, no one's hoping for our comeback on the fan site. Like, at all. The Phantom Thieves are evil. Shido and Akechi are just. It should be the other way around. They're manipulating information using the media. And I, like I already said, fake news. Leaving Akechi aside, we'll get back at him later. Our main issue is Shido. Were there any instances before when you didn't know the palace keywords? Well, there was the time with Futaba. We didn't know anything about her, so all we could do was make conjectures. Then why don't we just go directly and see Shido? That's impossible. He's surrounded by bodyguards and followers all the time. There's no way high school students can get an appointment with him either. Well, we do have an adult with us. We got two. No, that's still impossible. Besides, that's too dangerous a method. <sighs> well, this is a problem. What's with the ruckus outside? To everyone gathered before Young and Jaya Station. Oh, look at that! Isn't that an election campaign car? Shido. Oh, right! The candidates are currently campaigning! Make Japan great again! <laughs> there, I said it. I hope you're happy now. <laughs> I apologize for the commotion. I am a... Wait, did he just say Shido? Yeah, he did! Hmm? Man, talk about being lucky! <laughs> We can go check him out without an appointment now! Hey, Ryuji ran this way. By the way, did something happen? He didn't seem well a moment ago. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I humbly ask that you cast your vote for me, Masayoshi Shido. Let us all set sail toward a happy future, together. I hope to continue serving you all. Is that the guy? You guys wait here. I'll go get intel for us. Wait! Hey! Yo, Shido-san! Stand back. I just want to talk to him for a sec. He's a busy man. The hell? Ain't he supposed to hear a citizen's comments? That's enough, Brad. You're that asshole we met at the hotel before. At the elevators! Oh, I'm sorry. So you can butt in front of other people if you're in a hurry? What are you talking about? That moron! Come on, stop! But these guys... Hey, kid. You don't want to know what happens when you cross me. That voice. Seems the customer base has changed since I was here last. Have they started a daycare? This ain't a show. Get lost, kid. Damn brat! I'll sue! He's the one from before. What are you looking at? This country is filled with clueless children. I worry for Japan's future. Let them go. My next appointment is coming up. What a piece of shit. 
So what do you think after seeing him in person? He's why I got arrested. Wait! He's the jerk you told us about before? The same guy! For real? Seriously? You're sure, aren't you? Without a doubt. Shido's the one who ruined your life. Holy shit! I don't believe it! <sighs> Let's get going, okay? Shido's the guy who set you up? Well, I mean, I did knock the fuck out of him, so... What kind of fate brought you two back together? Probably something to do with the long-nosed man. I want to know myself. Talk about a destined connection. Shido was involved in the cognitive research too, right? This can't be dismissed as just a coincidence. God, what the hell's going on here? Shido was already a politician then, yet he sued a student and ruined his future? He must have pulled some strings so that his name wouldn't be mentioned. Furthermore, he also would have had to force that woman into making a false statement. He would do anything. We're talking about a man who ordered a hit inside the police station. He can't sit still until he crushes whoever opposes him, no matter how trivial. He's always been that way. What a piece of shit. Do I really need to say anything more about socialist politicians? Children are the future, my ass! What he's saying and doing are completely different! But now that we've found out who did it, can't something be done about his record? Insert Bernie Sanders You know, actually, that's a pretty good record on Sanders, though I'm not gonna try to talk- I'm gonna try not to mention too much politics here. Once the courts have made a judgment, overturning that decision will be difficult. It'd barely be possible even if proof of innocence is presented and Shido admits to his crimes. At any rate, we need to trigger a change of heart in him. Be that as it may, Shido's outer appearance and his true face are wholly different. It's beyond hypocritical. It's as if he's an entirely different person. He speaks about the good of the country. It makes me wonder what really is on his mind. That man's full of ambition to rise in the world. He only thinks of the weak as stepping stools for his success. He treats himself as an elite man while looking down on others. Ugh, that's the worst. Literally every politician ever. I assume the keyword for what he believes the diet building is will be despicable, too. It must be something self-centered and completely different from politics. Like a citadel? Someone like him needs to be punished as soon as possible. Let's head to the diet building again right after school tomorrow. I feel we'll get it this time. <sighs> Stewing over it won't get anywhere. We have to do this. Yeah, I'm trending around 3%. So there's still some support. Centered around Takamaki. Security guards became suspicious of us last time, so we can't stay here for long. 
but we still have no hit. Think it's a barrier after all? Where'd your enthusiasm from yesterday go? Ah, shut up. The real game starts at two outs. Enough chatting. You should only be thinking about the keyword. The citizens are secondary. He only cares about his own well-being and that of his lackeys. Sounds like an imperialist. He wants to become prime minister, even if it means trampling on others. Fortune, rich people. Hey, can you think of anything based on what you've heard from him? Just try saying anything. It doesn't matter if you guess. Incompetent fools like you just need to shut your mouths and follow where I steer this country. Steer? Maybe like a ship? A boat? It was a match? What? The diet building's a ship? What kind of scenery will that be? The actual building's on land! I can't even begin to imagine what it will be like. Well, whatever it is, looks like there are no barriers. Oh, sh shut up! Let's hurry up and go in! Are we clear of the guard's sight? Get closer to the wall, just in case. All right, do it. Ship? Hmm. Wait. Hey. How's it look over there? See anything? Nah, it's totally normal. I'll check it out. What's up, Futaba? <laughs> Futaba? Hmm? What is it? <laughs> the hell? Huh? <sighs> it's a cruise liner. That's interesting. This country may sink. He alone will survive. That's what this cognition is about, huh? This is bullshit! A country that children can be proud of my ass is completely sunken in his head! If a guy like this stands above everyone, we're seriously done for. This is beyond ridiculous. The same goes for Akechi. He should have seen this scenery as well. Yet he still aided Shido. It's for his own personal gain. What in the world is he thinking? Whether it be for glory or for simply a reward, my father died because of someone like this. We gotta sink Shido instead of this country. A palace with not just the center of the distortion, but the entire country sunken. I can't believe there's someone with this tremendous of a desire. Be careful. This will be completely different from past palaces. We're definitely gonna take his treasure. Business as usual. Come on, what a lame way to start this off. No? I think that's how it should be. We haven't failed yet, so if we calmly give this our all, the results will surely follow. We must put an end to this by December 17th, the day before the elections. Let the infiltration begin! Time to pay him back for setting us up into a trap. Then there's no time to lose. Wait.
You got it. Let's check it out. Indeed. And now we're threats. Um. Uh. That's. It looks like. You're right. I like this music better than Nijima's. Boss fight, so do you like bless? Normal damage. Get some good old win. Nope. Nuke. Prepare yourself. Resist. Well, then that means maybe psychic. No. Oof. How about just going for face? I mean, that's effective. Why do I only have three party members? That's weird. Why why did I only have three party members? Hmm. <laughs> That's weird. Uh, let's put Yusuke in. I haven't used him for a little while.
That went well. Huge doors are obviously suspicious. I wonder what's through here. There are slots to stick in something like a key card. Whoa, there's five of them. 475 people in favor. Zero against. I hear something. Since there is no one against the plan, this bill will be unanimously passed as drafted. Passed? What's going on? Was that Shiro's voice? If this truly is the representative's chamber as written, beyond here must be the main assembly hall. The what? It's that large conference room that's usually seen on the news. Oh, that thing! Gotcha! So, what are they doing inside? Most likely a meaningless vote. One in which whatever Shido proposes will always go unopposed. So he's doing whatever he wants by keeping only his supporters in there. What do we do to get in, though? Should we find these keycards? Maybe we need some kind of qualification. One that vows to be his follower or swear loyalty. So basically, we need to prove that we're on his side. We'll have to pretend. You sure move on quick. But what's this qualification thing about? Why don't we ask the guests on this ship? That could be dangerous. Asking around doesn't sound like a bad idea. The guests here are the cognitive versions of them in Shido's mind. They'll know any secrets he shared. True. You have a point. That said, the ruler here is that evil Shido. It wouldn't surprise me if they did turn hostile. Right. Yeah, wouldn't they attack us? We should prepare for the worst, of course. But I think we'll at least be able to talk to them. This ship is most likely an Ark loaded with those that Shido believes are worth keeping alive. It'd explain the luxury cruise ship. I doubt idiots who can't even hold a conversation would be here. We can at least gather information. It helps that everyone's wearing masks. We'll blend in even with our attire. He must believe that no one shows their true face to anyone else, just like him. Well then, let's split up and ask around. gun, something to sell. I can feel it. Okay, I do have to talk to these people. They're gathering information. Hmm. Um. 
Already talked with Yusuke. See it. Did I talk with Makoto? I don't remember. <sighs> yes. Um. Oh, Haru or Futaba. Get to the safe room, and I'm gonna end the episode there. Still, this is a surprise. All the cognitive guests in this palace seem like real humans. The casino earlier looked pretty real too, but talking with these guests was a whole nother story. You have that right. This ruler's observational skills and insight are off the charts. Shido's a formidable foe. Come on, no need to freak out. I'm not freaking out. I was just thinking it'll be easier to make a plan since they can talk normally. All right, let's put together the information we gathered. Huh, gotcha. Okay. You're right. It seems... Oh, ooey, I don't know. He's supposedly seen at the restaurant at night and sits at a table near the window. Um. Please right, cool. hear me. Company. Listen up. Um. You got it. Um. Uh. Ah, it's no you. I can only remember about two of them. What about you, Joker? I forgot all of them already. Oh dear lord. We're up against five people. The politician Owe, a former noble, a TV station president, an IT company president, and a cleaner. We get certification from them and obtain key cards that'll serve as letters of introduction. But only go for the cleaner after the other four have been dealt with, right? Whoa, now that's impressive! You go, genius! If we can't remember the details on the VIPs, let's reconvene inside a safe room. Okay. Right, let's get this done quickly. Hopefully they just mark hey. it on the map. Mm. Well. Oh, I can fuse right here. Let's do that real quick. Do you need something? You sir. The inmate needs our you wish to perform an execution to a world beyond this one. Let's do it. Very well. Let Let's see what begin. the wonderful world of the internet has for me. Cert? 
Whew. I'm certainly impressed. Now choose. Finished? Are you finished? No slacking off. Let's do it. I'm going to end this one here. Thank you all for watching. Join me next time on Persona 5 as I continue on through Shido's Palace. But until then, I am the Dark Seraph, signing off.